Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today I'm cooking a recipe that has chicken and peppers in it. This is a recipe that everybody loves, it's very popular in the UK and um, I thought maybe you could guess and see what I'm gonna cook but I'm gonna start now, so let's see. So we have some chopped tomato here, we have some onions, we have some red and green pepper, we have some yogurt, fenugreek leaves, coriander powder, ginger, garlic and bay leaf, um, this is some coriander, fresh coriander, some salt and the chicken. So the first thing we're going to do, we're going to fry the chicken. And for that we need some oil, which I'm going to, I'm going to add right now. Okay, perfect. We have to make sure we let this, um, we let this oil get really, really, really hot because we really want to give a nice color to the chicken. So that happens only if the oil is very hot. It's ready. So the first thing we're going to do, we're going to add the chicken in here and give it a nice color. Just um, make sure they're cooked all over on each side. I'm going to put this chicken on the side. Now in the same oil, in the same pan, I'm going to cook the onions. Here we go. Let these onions get nicely cooked, brown, light brown. So my onions are cooking now. So what I really want to tell you and I encourage you guys to do is cook home. Cooking home is so easy, it can be so much fun, it's healthy because you know what you're cooking. So this is something we really enjoy to do and I really encourage everybody to do as much as possible. Eat home, eat healthy. I'm going to add now the ginger and garlic. And this is bringing such a flavor to our dish. It's incredible. Some people don't like garlic and ginger, uh, but when you really add it into the food, it's bringing an, an amazing flavor. Here's some garam masala, about uh, one teaspoon. I'm adding that to the pot. And then we are adding the rest of the ingredients, which is um, coriander, ground coriander. And then we need to add fenugreek. Give it a nice stir all around. We need to add the peppers next. Here we go. We're going to add the tomatoes now. Here we go. We have to let this cook for about 15 minutes on a medium heat with the lid on. I'm going to add the chicken in a minute. Here we go. And this will have to cook here for about 5 to 10 minutes. 10 minutes, let's say. Don't add this last, let's say, part. I'm going to take the lid off now. It is almost done. I'm just going to add the yogurt. In the meantime, my, my rice is cooking over here. And this is almost ready. I'm just going to have a little taste and see how it is. If it needs anything more. I think I need, need to add a bit more salt. Salt. That's fine. Stir in a little. 
and then I'm going to plate it. Yay! I'm going to add some coriander, fresh coriander. Mix in gently. This smells amazing. You guys have to try this. It's so easy and so good. This would make a perfect dinner or lunch. That's it. So here you are guys. I hope you like this video. We add a bit of coriander. Here we go. Mmm, how does that look, eh? It does taste amazing though. So finally, let's reveal the recipe. The recipe is Balti chicken with the peppers. Thank you for watching and bye for now.